the learning of Quran, the recitation of Quran, and seeking the knowledge of Quran, and then acting upon the commandments and teachings of Quran is going to help people not only in this world and this worldly life, but it is also going to help the person in all the stages of life hereafter, like as if in the grave. Hazrat Bura bin Azib who reports that Prophet said that two angels come to the believer in the grave and they make the believer sit and they ask him, who is your Lord? And he says, my Lord is Allah. And then they ask him, what, what was your religion? And he says that my religion is Islam. And then they say, they ask him, what do you think about the person who was sent to you as prophet? He says, he is really the prophet of Allah, sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. And then these angels, they ask the believer, how did you come to know of all this? And you know what the person will say? He would say, I read the book of Allah and put faith in it. And this is what made me know and answer all the questions. So this is the book of Allah knowing, learning, seeking knowledge about the book of Allah is going to help the person answer all the questions in the grave. And similarly, as Abu Huraira narrates that Prophet said that when the believer is buried in the grave and the angels of torment they appear, then how and what will be the deeds which are going to stop these angels of torment? Prophet said that when they approach from the right side, it is the salah, the salah of the person will stand up and they will stop the angels from that side. And then the angels would come from the foot end and the footsteps of the person he used to take towards the mosque will be the deterring factor for the angels. And then these angels of torment, they will come from the left side and the zakat will obviously stop them. And when they will come from the front side, the supererogatory charity beyond zakat is going to stop them. And when the angels will come from the head end, the recitation of the Quran, the knowledge of Quran, and the contact and connection with Quran will stop these angels. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, help us all connect with Quran. Help our children connect with Quran. And Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, let none in our family and our progenies be, be deprived of the connection for Quran. اللهم انفعني بما علمتني وعلمني ما ينفعني وزدني علما